Governor Mike DeWine and the Ohio Department of Health are recommending any group gatherings be suspended for the time being. And that includes recommending no spectators be allowed at indoor sporting events. Again, just a recommendation at this point. A 2 News reporter Deborah Bogart joins us live with the latest developments regarding coronavirus in Ohio. Today, Governor Mike DeWine says these recommendations come after a discussion with physicians and other experts. He says right now these are just recommendations. They have not gotten to the point where they are mandatory yet. Now, right now, they are not recommending that K-12 through schools be closed, but he says parents and educators need to be prepared as that could change. For colleges and universities, they have recommended the schools screen students who are returning from spring break if they were on a cruise or got, went out of the country to eliminate a lit international travel and go to remote learning, which means no in-person classes. Now they are recommending sports events from the high school level to college and professional to have no spectators for indoor events. They say outdoor sports can continue, but that could change. They say prisons and nursing homes should suspend visitations and only allow critical contractors inside and to take the temperature for those who are permitted inside. Now, right now, there are still only three confirmed cases in Ohio, but DeWine says they are doing these recommendations because they are learning from what has happened in other countries. There is a point in time where you have to get, you can't get in front of it. That's probably not the way to say it because you, you, you know, you're not stopping it from coming in, but we're slowing down. The goal, our goal, is to dramatically slow down the spread, uh, thus saving lives and thus, at the same time, maybe getting us through this period. We don't know how long this period is going to be, but this period of danger. Due to these recommendations, presidential candidates Bernie Sanders and Joe Biden have canceled tonight's rallies in Cleveland. Also, the Ohio State Athletic Association has officially announced that all sporting events will continue with limited spectators. We have reached out to the NCAA and University of Dayton about plans for the first four. We'll update you on those plans as the details become available.